You are listening to I Am Refocused Radio with your host, Shamaya Reed. This show is designed to inspire you to live your purpose and regain your focus. And now, here's your host, Shamaya Reed. Hey, welcome to I Am Refocused Radio. We are here once again. And today we're going to be talking to a true honored guest, Mr. Jocko Willink, and he's the author of Final Spin. He is a decorated Navy SEAL, and we're going to learn about his amazing new project. I just want to welcome you to the show and say, how you doing, sir? Hey, Shamaya, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. So, man, tell us about this awesome book. What was the process like developing this project? Well, part of the process of this project was just growing up and keeping my eyes open and, and meeting a bunch of people along the way and developing characters in my head. That's that's what the that's where the book came from. The book is about a couple brothers the older brother has a uh, mental disability. He's functional, but he's kind of socially awkward, and he just absolutely loves laundry. He loves doing laundry. He loves cleaning laundry. He loves folding laundry, and he actually works in a laundromat. His younger brother, who's about 23 years old, is a real sharp guy, smart, funny, charismatic, but he's made some bad choices in his life. And he has now gotten to a point where he's working as a stock boy in a big box store, just kind of going through the grind, the daily grind, not much, uh, not much light on the horizon for him. And he finds out that the laundromat where his older brother works is going to be sold. And the younger brother thinks if that laundromat gets sold, his older brother's going to lose his job and he won't be able to be happy. So his younger brother says, you know what, I'm going to buy that laundromat. But the only way he can figure out to get enough money to buy the laundromat is by stealing it. So he comes up with a plan with his best friend to rip off the store where they work. And unfortunately, things don't always go as planned. So that's the story, at least the beginning of it. And this is awesome because you have a you have other books that you are best selling off as well. What is the takeaway as far as this book and, and how is it different from the others as far as your point of view? Yeah. So all the other books that I've written, especially the adult books, I've written a bunch of kids books as well. Those are all stories and they're fiction, but they have some pretty poignant points that I'm trying to get across. And the leadership books that I've written are, are about leadership strictly, but you're right. There is an underlying theme here and a bunch of underlying themes and lessons to take away from this book. You know, primarily how do you treat other people? Um, what is it? What, what is a, the best pathway to find happiness in the world? What is the real meaning of sacrifice? And, and really, the other thing is just trying to help people understand human nature by in, by introducing all these different characters and putting them into a challenging scenario. And once again, to honor talking to Jocko Willink, you are also a podcast host and you also are the CEO, co-founder of Echelon Front. And you can go to echelonfront.com to learn about that. But speaking of leadership, how important, especially with your military experience, thank you for your service, how important is that to pass forward, so to speak, for just not just people, for the next generation? Yeah, to me, leadership is the most important skill that a human being can have. <laughs> and and I've racked my brain to figure out if there's anything that's more important than leadership. But we all know that you can only accomplish great things with a team. And if you have a team, you need to have leadership. So I think it's the most critical skill that a person can have. And that's why I've really dedicated my adult life to try and pass on these lessons that we learned on the battlefield so that everyone can improve their leadership capability. And once again, you can check out his amazing new novel, his final spin. You can get it everywhere at Amazon. Man, before we let you go, I'll let you have the true honors. What do you want to tell the audience? I just want to say uh, thanks for the support. I know there's a lot of veterans out there. We got Veterans Day coming up, and I appreciate everyone's service for keeping this country free. 